morning. It's an early morning in January. And as you might have guessed already, I am here for the very first Air France 787 flight. So I'm gonna be one of the first actual passengers to fly on the aircraft. And we're going from Paris today, obviously, to Paris, which is fun. It's, that's only happened once before that I've taken off and landed at the same airport, which was, oh my gosh, okay, forget that. Here's the aircraft. So I'm super excited. I even got a window seat. Um, check it out. This is the new premium economy on Air France. Awesome, thank you. <laughs> so we have a little typical Air France amenity kit and the bag. Welcome 787, I love this little duffel bag. Plus, a pretty firm pillow. And the way. So I love this seat back pocket design because it's like super adapted to the modern day, you know, when you want to have a smartphone in one, maybe like your passport in the other, you can just really store everything easily so it doesn't just fall into the pocket and disappear forever like it usually does when I'm flying economy. Then this is also amazing because the power ports are so easily accessible as opposed to being under here like they usually are, you can just plug it in right there uh, so a row of three shares two power ports. Um, let's see, a little cup holder. The tray table extends as usual. Um, and of course, we have USB, headphone jack. Let's click English and see what happens. That's just an introduction to the entertainment system. But then, of course, as always, on the 787, we have the we have the dimmable window shades. And then I'm in 19A today, literally in the middle of the wing. Um, this is awesome. Everyone's just standing up, excited. Wah wah. For some reason, my microphone was not working on this clip, but I really want to show you because I went through the little bag. I don't know why I called it a duffel bag. It is definitely not. Um, but yeah, the little gift bag we got from Air France. So the first piece they had was this awesome cap. So, so cool. Totally a collector's item, um, which I will enjoy a lot. Uh, I might at some point give it away. I had the urge to do it, um, but right now I'm just so in love with it. I don't know if I'm ready. Then just some stickers. They sort of reminded me of those stickers you get when you buy like a Mac or an iPhone typical Apple stickers, um, a screen cleaner, which ended up being really handy for cleaning my camera lens, actually. And I don't know what I'm saying. Oh, one of those little luggage tags. This is like the most fun type of unboxing ever. <laughs> anyway, thanks so much, your friends. Let's continue on with the video without any more technical difficulties. Roll the clip. <laughs>
out this little menu for today's flight. Let's have a look. Open Air France 787, just mature. A little info, I think we all know 787 is more fuel efficient, blah, blah, blah. Um, there is a new premium economy seat uh, from Air France on this aircraft, um, which well, I, hopefully I'll have time to have a look at later. But they also have their top of the line business class. Um, so I'm surprised they aren't pushing that any harder. Um, here's what we're doing today, and this is, this I'm really excited about. As you can see, there's champagne, festivities, surprise guests live from the 787. Hmm. Special photo event. Here's our route. So judging by the in-flight map, we've been flying south east. So looking at here, it seems like we're starting by going to for then Geneva, that's awesome. And then Marseille will be flying over the Alps here. Toulouse to wave at Airbus. Bordeaux. Michel and back to Paris. What an awesome schedule. And then we have our menu for today. So it's meal time. We have a little champagne. And of course the food itself. So I think these two are desserts. Here's a little quiche. And a little sandwich. Then we also have a fruit salad and free leaves. It's a little meal, but it's perfectly fine for this short flight. Special catering just for today. Normal mood lighting. Here is the new premium economy again. I'm really curious about the recline. I mean, this is in my seat, but I sort of want to just see what it looks like. <laughs> Let's see. So the recline buttons are right there. And then there's a footrest, some storage on the side, um, seat back pocket, big tray table. And what's really good about these, these uh, hard cover seats is that they don't recline into each other. So you're not faced with... Uh, yeah, you can work at any time during the flight, basically. Then here is the main crew galley. <laughs> And the business class cabin up in front. So this looks like a pretty standard uh, reverse herringbone seat, but it actually seems like there's a lot of footroom. 
So I'm guessing your friends might choose to put a little self-serve bar here on long-haul business class flights with maybe some snacks and then of course beverages and up here there's some uh, just information for today's flight. Busy flight attendants. But anyway, uh, I'm here on the Air France 787 and I wanted to tell you about where this will fly. And it's actually pretty cool because it will be, er like, to start, be serving the pretty short route between, uh, easy, yeah, between Paris and Cairo, um, which is an interesting choice to launch the 787 on. Um, but I imagine it's a huge upgrade for the passengers. Uh, who are flying that route. But then we'll also be doing some really short um, crew and uh, cockpit crew, crew training flights, I think, from uh, London to Paris, back and forth. Just like Air France did with the E380, it's an awesome chance to try their product, both in business and in economy class. Um, and of course, if you want to try the new premium economy. But then, in the long run, it will be serving Atlanta, uh, Montreal, of course, and a few other destinations. Um, and especially if you're flying Air France in business class, I haven't had the chance to actually try the cabin, but I know it's meant to be an amazing seat. Air France are meant to have an amazing soft product. I think it, um, this is the choice to go with. So I'm here with Air France flight attendant Thierry. We're just gonna ask him some questions about what it will be like to work on the 787. So, uh, what, what's most exciting for Air France about it? So it's a completely new airplane, the last new airplane we get for the 380. Completely new seats in business, economy and premium economy. Premium economy is a completely different seat from the other best cabin. And that is a good part as well. It's uh, like really exciting because we just start with a new airplane, so it's really exciting. Uh, this airplane 787 is replacing the 380. The 340, yeah. sorry. 340. Yeah. Yeah. It's a good 380. <laughs> little bit. Yeah, yeah. Same exact uh, because it's 275. Oh, okay. Awesome. So, same amount. Right. So the 380 will be phasing out of the fleet and they will okay. be replaced by the 787. So this will go to St. Martin someday. Maybe they will be. <laughs> oh, we'll all be excited. <laughs> for that, that, that the A340 goes there now. Yes, right? it's, yeah, yeah. But for the first destination, we we'll start with so, to Cairo from Monday and London in February before the Cairo flight. And with the second aircraft, we we'll are starting to fly to uh, Montreal, Lyon in France, and the third aircraft, which is coming in September, will be flying to Atlanta. Right. So up to the third aircraft, I know. After I don't know. Okay, okay. <laughs> Exciting times in Air France. Yeah, it's good. It's yeah. good. <laughs>
So guys, that was all for today and the special inaugural flight of Air France's beautiful 787. I think they did such a good job on that plane. To me, the one biggest highlight of the 787, like I've said before, is the high cabin humidity. It just makes it so much easier to breathe and sleep and everything on board. I can't wait for passengers to get to try it out. I'm so, so honored I got to join today. So grateful. I'd like to thank everyone at Air France for making this amazing day possible and for putting so much work into planning the event. Uh, I'm on my way to my hotel now to get my suitcase. I wish I could stay in Paris, but I have to catch my flight tonight. Paris is one of my favorite cities in the world, so I'm kind of bummed. But anyway, I need to get home and work. I'm going to South Africa next week. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button and of course, subscribe for more like this. I have many more exciting events coming soon. And of course, comment below what you thought. Uh, there's many more videos from this flight which you can check out in links here. And until I see you guys next time, fly safe.